Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to our Tuesday Skyward Sword episodes. The cafe's open. Grab a hot drink. We're going to go start the uh, Ancient Cistern is what it's called. I forgot that I needed to go to the sky. Uh, to the sky. Uh, yeah, I got my coffee with me, so make sure you got something, too, because this one's going to be a little bit rough. I don't like the Ancient Cistern very much. But we got to do it, so we'll do it. I'm also a little bummed that we missed out on that goddess cube, and I'm gonna have to go back and get it at some point, but not today. Maybe I'll have an episode where I do side quests and stuff and get the rest of the goddess cubes. But that's gonna have to wait for a little bit because I don't have all of the items that I need. Okay, back to Lake Floria we go. Right? Is this? Yes. Right? Hey. Nice. Okay, um, is it this way? Nope, it's this way. Yeah, here. Oh, there's a chest up here that I missed. Oh. Oh, and there's a goddess cube over there. How about that? What we got? A goddess plume. We've already read that. We know what it is. Okay. Man, these guys really do not like giving jelly blobs. Come here. There we go. Big old car outside or something. Making lots of <laughs> noise. Okay, uh, which way? That way. Okay, we've got to hop over this thing. And then we go, ah, down here. There we go. Whoops, what did I hit? Did I hit one of those spike things? I didn't even see. Just trying to make our way back to the dragon. There we go. This should be, I hope this is the right way. Yeah, yeah. Yoink. Okay. Hello. Oh, no. Oh, you can't be serious. Did I just dump it out? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I just dumped it out. <laughs> hey, you know what this is a good time for? To go get that goddess cube that I missed. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I can't believe I just wasted, like, 20 minutes of time just now. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Well, here we go. Oh, did you see last time when I blew up the Sheikah Stone and it took off like a rocket like an Ocarina of Time? In case you missed it. Yeah. Why not? Let's just repeat the beats of last episode. <laughs> and then another one grows. I'm gonna get this amber relic too while I'm at it. Oh, I'm so upset about that. I'm just not having a good. I'm just not having a good day with Skyward Sword today. Oh, there is one here that I can. Okay, where is this? No, I can't. I can't use this one, can I? Give me. Thank you. And this isn't a thing. I guess not. So. Or did I just not use that statue before? I guess I could just do this. Master, I have information to report. By my estimates, you are currently situated in the southwestern area of Farron Woods. Please confirm your location with your map. Wow. 
Thanks for the info. Oh, hello. Okay, uh, is there... Is there a uh, statue around here somewhere? I can't really see, can I? Dang, okay. That's alright. I'm just gonna go back and use the statue. Because it's much simpler that way. Come here. I want all the bugs. Um, but I'll just grab that grasshopper and... Oh. What's this? Is it on the water? Oh, it's going down. Oh, well. Bye. Bummer. Okay, to this guy. I thought that I could warp, or, you know, come down right onto this statue, but apparently not. Or maybe I just missed it. Guess we'll find out. Oh boy, here we go. Oh wait, I can probably buy the goddess shield. You know what, since I'm already doing extra stuff, let's just... I think I have enough to buy the goddess shield, let's just go do that. And there is... okay, this one is unlocked now, but it's in... Oh, it's in Stormhead. I might as well just do that when I go grab the next song. This is ridiculous. Sheesh. At least it makes it more entertaining, if not, you know, just frustrating that I have to backtrack and do more stuff. And there's already enough backtracking in Skyward Sword. Okay. Oh no, oh, hang on a second. I see you're looking well these days. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you'd found the time to gather all the variety of magnificent treasures. Come, come closer. If it's treasure you seek, I'll use my mystical vision to find answers for you. No thanks, I'm good. Hey, bro. How much for this one? 500. Yes, I will take it. Oh, I have to go drop some off? Okay. Oh, that's why. I could buy it. I just didn't want to because I because of the shield that I already used. Uh, yep, item check. Uh, I'm checking out. Yep, all right, we've already talked. Sorry. Um, I mean, honestly, might as well just sell it. Let's sell it. Get that out of here. Um. Hmm. I mean, I don't really need this right now either. I know that I didn't want to sell it before, but if I'm gonna get the Goddess Shield then. Whatever. Let's see if I can even upgrade it. All right, one of these, please. Or sacred shield. It's not a goddess shield yet. I have to repair it, or not? Repair it. I have to uh, upgrade it. Um, it also repairs this over time. Yep. Aha! Thank you for your loyal and continued patronage, friend. I have taken the liberty of placing your purchases in your pouch. Press R to open, then equip what you need. Thank you. Let's go talk to uh, what's your name? Gondo. Hey, kid. How's Scrapper treating you? Anything to upgrade today? Yes. Let's upgrade the shield. You got it. These are all the items you have that I can upgrade right now. Ooh, I can upgrade this guy. Ah, uh, but that's what I that's what I need a hornet lord before. Okay. Uh this guy. Okay, I I could do an, an upgraded slingshot. Hey, perfect. Let's do it. All right, you want to upgrade this? There's no going back, you hear? Let's do it. Okay. You just wait right there. Sweet. This totally is worth it. Um to sell the reinforced shield because it was 80 rupees and my wooden shield that I sold was 20 rupees so it already made my money back. All done, here you go. Nice, divine shield. This mystical shield can repair itself over time. It's also more durable. All right, let's, try, let's see if we can upgrade it one more time. Uh, oh, okay, we need three more bird feathers, three more monster horns and only one more dusk rat. Like, dang, that's, we're so close. Uh, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about that right now. We'll go ahead and um, just do the slingshot. Because my hope is that this will last us long enough to get the Hylian shield. So let's just go ahead and upgrade the slingshot. And maybe we can upgrade the net too. And we can look at the bond bag as well. Okay. Got the scatter shot. 
So now, uh, your shots will now pepper a wide range. Hold ZR to increase your shot power. Nice. Okay, let's see. Hey! Oh, I needed an evil crystal to upgrade my bug net. It's kind of weird, but okay. Let's do it. Oh, I guess I should have read it, but that's okay. Uh, I'm just kind of going because I've wasted so much time before. Okay, I need ornamental skulls to upgrade this. But I'm not too worried about bomb bags. Great. Thanks. Thanks, come again. You soon, you're here. Okay. Um, yeah, you're talking about the hand in the bathroom, I think. I'm not too worried about that right now either. Have fun. I've got work to do. Sorry, Beetle, I don't have money to spend today. I spent it all on other things, such as upgrades. Yeah. We gotta head back to Farron pretty quick here. Don't got time for messing around. I deprived myself of that luxury when I poured the water out right in front of the dragon instead of giving it to her. I can't believe myself. I don't think I've ever done that before. Yoink. Okay, let's head back to the Skyview Temple real quick. Okay, let's just rush this real quick and get it done. There aren't any bees around here, are there? Because I would love to use that larva. I know there's some over there, but I'm not going to go all the way over there just to get bees. It, are, are there some over here? I don't think there are, but it doesn't hurt to do a quick look. Okay. My shield is so shiny. That's much faster. I don't know why I try and do anything else. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, hit this butterfly wall again. Oh, and I still got caught on it. Man, I hate these spider webs. So annoying. Okay, uh... No, I guess not. Oh! But there's an, uh, an amber relic here. Oh, Monster Claw. I do need that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I guess I can't do this. Oh, another Monster Claw. This wall again. I'm pretty sure it was right there. But let's just go. Before that pufferfish thing comes after us. Oh, not this again. Okay, nope. I'm just running right past you. See ya. Well, actually, I could use the money, honestly. Ouch. Well, that's not... There we go. I'm telling you, spamming that is much more efficient than the way you're supposed to do it. Silly keys. Okay, now we're full up on bombs. Get this guy out of here. Didn't mean to grab the net, meant to grab this. So we can just get these Deku Babas out of here. I'm pretty sure these guys are called Deku Babas. Oh, I missed him. Dang it. Okay. It's okay, we'll just come around here. And do this. And turn. Nice. That was much faster than last time. We're learning. Go on. There you go. Good job. Okay. 
Oh, good. I was worried we are going to have to do that whole room again with the two snake guys. I hope I don't have to do the three Stalfos again. That'd be a bummer. But my thought is that since they were essentially just acting as a kind of mini-boss for, um... Well, I better back up. Oh, yeah, I better back up. Jeez. Um, for, like, this mini-dungeon, I'm not too worried about it. We should be fine. Yoink! Headshot! Alright, let's go. You're doing great. You can make it. There you go. Okay. Hey, thanks. One of the bummer thing about those... Well, it's not actually really a bummer, I suppose, but like... Um, with those little diggy holes... If you start to dig up rupees, you're only going to get rupees. If you start to dig up hearts, you're only going to get hearts. So it's, it's like the variety is not as massive as if you were cutting like uh, grass. But that's okay. Is there a bug in here? I thought I saw a bug on the wall. I going to say, that would be very strange. Okay, now don't, don't dump out the water when you get back to the dragon. Should be common sense. But unfortunately, we had to learn the hard way. Is that a bluebird? Oh no, those are fish. That's a bluebird. Okay, well I got one. Oh. Okay, and we'll go get that goddess cube. Thanks, I guess. Alright, where is it? There it is. Yoink. Nice. Okay. Oh, right. Sacred water. And now I'm actually okay with Fi taking me right out. Thank you. Very helpful this time. And I'll come back this way just to get the bees. Oh, ho, 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 ho. got it. Okay. That went so much better than the last few times that I fought these guys. Okay, is there anything in this tree? Just some seeds. That's okay. We'll take them. Hey! Nice. Oh, a jelly blob. Thanks. What, what do you say? Glittering spores cause something to happen when they are thrown on bugs or monsters. They can be collected from sparkly mushrooms. Honestly, I would try that out if it didn't take up so much space to only be used once. Like, if you got three or four or five uses out of, um, out of the uh, sparkling spores, I'd use it a lot more. Turn around, turn around, Bean. There you go. Uh, hello? I'd like that. There we go. Oh, hello. Sheesh. Okay. Well, now we can upgrade the, uh, the, um, flying beetle thing. So that's pretty cool. Oh, bye. Okay. Hmm. Head back up here. Bye. <clears throat> okay, I can go this way. Good. Oh, hello. Turn around. Sheesh. 
Sometimes the camera in this game. Whoa, hello. Hey, that's not cool, man. Sheesh. And you didn't even, you didn't even give me anything. How rude. Can't believe it. Oh, they're coming after me. Oh, they're coming. Let's get out of here. Okay. So where? Big Flory is over there. Oh, I'm all the way on the other side. Oh, dang it. Okay. Well. All right, here we go. Guess we're just going back to the sky. And if I'm just doing this, let's see where that other goddess chest is that just got unlocked. This is not at all what I was planning on doing today. Um, okay, it's over at the Lumpy Pumpkin. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and do it. Okay, I think it's the one that's on the the roof. Yep, it's this one. Alright, let's hope it's good. Hey, 300 rupees. Okay, that that is all, that is alright. I'll take that. Maybe now we can go visit Beetle's ship shop. Or Beetle's shop ship. Whichever it is. It's his flying cabin. That he uses bicycle power to keep afloat. And we'll upgrade the beetle real quick. I know, very confusing because there's two different kinds of beetles here. One with a T, one with a D. But we're talking about upgrading our little fetch item and then talking to our shop friend. Whee! I think I want to talk to Beetle first. Where is he? Beetle. Hello. Where is he? There he is. Grab it. There you go. No, nope, grab it. Thank you. Whee! Okay. Let's see what he's got for us today. Uh, bug medallion, the heart medallion, and a pouch. Oh. Yeah, adventure pouch. Oh, 1,200. Oh, yikes. Oh. No, thank you. Sorry. How much is this one? 800? Oh. 800, yeah. I don't, I'm sorry, Beetle. I don't have enough. And this bug medallion is like a thousand or something. Yeah, sorry, Beetle. I know. Sorry, man. I didn't want to not buy anything. I just don't have enough money. Okay, do not pour that thing out. Just wanted to make sure that I had it. Hello. Yeah, can you upgrade my uh, beetle real quick? Thank you. Only 50 rupees. Wow. And now it'll be faster. Oh, I can skip. I should probably just do that. Thanks. Nice. Oh, wait. I can upgrade it again. Let's see what I can upgrade, with, with, upgrade it with. Uh, okay, I need two more ancient flowers, and then, ooh, I can upgrade its stamina. And then that should be the fully upgraded beetle at that point, actually. So... Uh, I won't be able to get to that until 
I go back to the Lanera region, which isn't going to be for a little bit, unfortunately. Because I'm pretty sure that once I get Feror's Flame, I actually go to the Elden region. And then I go to the Lanera region. I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's... I'm pretty sure that's how it works. And then, yeah, the other goddess chest is in... Stormhead, I don't want to go over there right now. Alright, let's see if we can drop in close to, um... Uh, Miss Water Dragon. Dive, dive! Okay, uh, this one. Hey! I knew it. I was like, if I use that statue to go up into the sky, then surely I should be able to access it from the sky, right? I just didn't actually look for it. My bad. Okay. Now let me talk to her before I just start dumping water everywhere. Yoink. Hello. Mmm. Yes, just look at that color. There's no doubt this is the water I need. Quickly, boy, pour it into my basin. This is giving me Breath of the Wild Great Fairy vibes. Mmm, exquisite! I can feel its energy surging through me. Behold, the full majesty of Faron, water dragon and guardian of these lands. I stand tall healed. I stand tall healed. Oh, I stand tall, healed and whole once again. They don't put a space in the hyphens on these, and so it makes me think that it's a compound word, but it's not. Human, you have done well to bring me the sacred water I asked you for. I see now it was no coincidence that you completed the goddess's trial and obtained a water dragon's scale. In turn, I will grant you the favor you have asked of me and lead you to the sacred flame of my land. Come. Now, behold. Um... And there she sounded like Xant. Go, the sacred flame you seek lies within this place. While the waterfall has barred entrance to this site for many years, monsters have still found a way in, and inside they flourish. Ah, but you are the goddess's chosen hero. Swatting a few monsters will be no trouble for you. I imagine you and I will cross paths again. Until then, do not lower your guard. There's another car outside or something. Farewell, boy. This entrance. Well, first of all, it looks like the Zora's Domain uh, piece in Breath of the Wild, which is pretty cool. I'm sure that's a reference uh, to this. But also, it looks like... Could you not? But also, it looks like the the uh, architecture in the Jonah Veggie Tales movie for Nineveh. Okay, let's try this again. Go down and up, and then do jump. There we go. Okay, finally made it to the ancient cistern. Only thirty minutes into the episode, when we could have entered it right away. Very ridiculous. Cafe is serving salted chips today. Yeah, I'm a little bit salty. We got salted caramel. That's our special. Be careful not to burn your tongue on the tea. It's a little hot.
Okay, we made it to the ancient cistern, finally. I do not like this dungeon very much. It is rather confusing. And the whip is okay, but it's not it's not the best item. It's not like it's kind of cool because in the same vein as Wind Waker, you can use it to get treasure from monsters if you hit them with it. But like that's about as far as its general use goes. Hello. And not a single Oh my goodness, they really are stingy with jelly blobs. I'm not trying to be like super mad today. It's just I feel like it's so ridiculous that the creature that jelly blobs come from almost never give jelly blobs. Okay. I know that if I land on that, it's gonna turn over. But I don't really have a choice. Like, hey, wow, look, the spiky thing came to the top. Okay. Um, I can't get up there yet. I think I have to come from the other side. And I can't go back up that way, but I can go back up this way. Yeah. Hello. Hmm. And that brings me back up there. Okay. Oh, there we go. I can just, uh, flip him upside down. Good to know. No, okay, I thought the doorway was going to get in the way. <laughs> Maybe a little nervous. Uh, okay, go this way. Oh, one of these puzzles. Oh, I don't like these ones. Okay, what do you have to say? Strike the... Oh my goodness, I can't read that. Strike the gemstones pointing in four directions wisely. The way will op the way will only open for one who knows the temple's secret order. Okay, so I can't be here yet. Great. Um, I'm not gonna remember that, but that's okay. I'll find my way back. Okay, let's hop back up here. And I think I might be able to actually cheese this treasure chest here. Nope, just barely can't reach it. That's okay. I'm not supposed to be able to reach it yet anyway. Okay, let's head back to the main room. Head up here. Okay. I can't go over there yet because I need the whip to do that. Um. Oh boy. This is the hardest part about this dungeon in my uh, experience, is just getting started. Okay, there's a there's a little message board over there that I can look at. I don't need these hearts. Eh. Okay. Carved into the great statue are inscriptions of gratitude. They reveal the secret order of this temple. First the back, then the rear. Wait. First the back, then the rear, then the back of the right hand, and finally the back of the left hand. What? Am I going to have to write this down? I'm going to have to write this down. Or just grab my notes on my phone. Oh. I don't have a... Uh, actually... I'll just write it on the back of here, I suppose. Okay. This is so exciting. Back of right hand, back of left hand. Okay. Okay. Well, let's go see if we can access the back of the statue real quick, I suppose. Hmm. 
Okay, so top. Wait. No, that's not it. Oh, hello. Okay, yeah, top, bottom. And then we need to look at the hands. Get up there. Hello? Please? Okay. Let's see. Where are the hands? I want to access the hands, please. Oh, here they are. Oh, but it's the back of them. Oh, dang. Okay. Okay, now I can look at it. And this is the left hand. So, top, bottom, left, right, I would assume. But we'll have to go check this other hand. Okay, see, this is the problem I have had with this dungeon, is I never knew that I was supposed to do it like this. So maybe, maybe I've just been doing it wrong and that's why I've been having a hard time with this dungeon in the past. Okay, and then cruise through here. And then we'll double check this one. Top, bottom, left, right. Okay. I think I just always trialed and errored that puzzle. No wonder I hate this dungeon. Okay. Take two. Spiderwebs are here again. What's the point? Oh, my sword is so short. Sheesh. There we go. Wow, imagine if I actually looked around for the things that would tell me what I was supposed to do. I call myself a Zelda fan. Although I do like traditional dungeons like this, just in general. Okay, let's see. Yep. Ow! Dang it. And I call myself a Zelda fan. Can't even get a Skulltula. There we go. Thank you. Okay. What's next? Ooh, okay. Gotta go to that one over there. But let's just, um... Wow, he does move faster. That's so cool. You can do the speed-up option. Fantastic. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, it's underwater now. Dang. Okay, well, let's go ahead and just head over here again. Oh, what's down here? Let me immediately get distracted by something that uh, does not matter to my current puzzle whatsoever. There you go, turn around. Okay. Boom. Okay. Let's see. Am I supposed to hop this one? 
Ah, there we go. Now I can access this little pathway down here. There we go. Hey, 20 rupees. Nice. Okay, is there anything behind me over here? Nope, oh, okay. Alright. Hey, and here's that uh, chest. Oh, wait, is this is this the whip, like, immediately? Oh, okay, it's just a key. Well, where's a locked door? I haven't seen a locked door that I remember. At least not one that I can even access. Oh, wait, is there one, like, literally right here? Or is that the... Or is that the... Boss door? Maybe it is just a locked door. That's the whole point of exploration, so let's do it. Okay, back to the front. Okay, I guess it is just a locked door. I'm trying to do this dungeon as quickly as I can because... Not that I take my take extra time on the other ones per se, but... I wasted so much time at the beginning of this episode for no reason. I just want to be able to actually do this and get it done. Okay, so I can't get up there without the whip, which is fine. That's how it's supposed to be, but do I, am I supposed to go down? I mean, I guess. Oh, I'm supposed to use my parasail. That's what it is. Or, um, sailcloth. That's what it is. Hey, man. How's it going? Alright, time to quadruple wield. Okay. Man, he did that so many times in a row. Oh! 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 oh. oh. Okay. Ouch. Okay, only two hearts, though. That's not too bad. Ow. Well, they do add up, though. Oh, nice. I definitely could have done that smoother, but... I'm, I am being a little bit careless today. Not, not a good thing, but... I will say, though, I do kind of like the underground portion of this... of this dungeon. Come on, there you go. There it is. You got the whip. Attached to the end of the whip is a strange glowing sphere of light that can latch onto various things. If you see something you can't reach, target it with ZL and snag it with your whip. Snap! Alright. This is the, the whip. Oh, interesting. You can... You can uh, if you have it extended, you can push uh, down the R analog to uh, snap it back. Nice. Okay, here we go. Whee! All right, let's head... I mean, there's no reason not to go ahead and just activate all these. What's out here? Okay. Not really any reason to do that right now. Let's see. Okay, and this just brings me to the top. Which I don't need to be at yet.
Yoink, yoink. Okay. Head back up to this level. And go on out. And we'll see what we can do. Okay. Um, can't reach anything right there. But we can reach something over here. Okay, well, first you gotta turn around. And get up here. Oh my gosh. I hate these leaf, these little leaf pad things. Can I just... Can I just hop onto it? Oh my goodness, I can. Oh, that's so dumb. And I hopped onto the wrong one anyway. Okay. There we go. I do remember that. Oops. Well, let's uh, get back on there. Thank you. And that stops that, so that means I can go in that other tunnel down there. I think. Or is that not a tunnel? Oh, it is. Yoink. Oh! He webbed me! Can't believe it. That was very rude. Is there anything back here? Hey, a small chest. Sweet. Money? 20 rupees. Nice. Can I not go in here yet? Someone tells me I wasn't supposed to be here. something. I think I touched a spiky that I was not supposed to touch. Oops. Okay. Set up here. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. That was kind of funny, though. What's this? Map? Hopefully. Hey! Got the map! Fantastic. Okay. Um, I can't go up there. Oh! Hello. Didn't realize you were up there. Um. Okay, I think I need to... Oh! There we go. Very interesting birds. They look kind of cool, but, uh... Okay. Okay, I'm obviously supposed to go somewhere in here. What am I missing? Hmm... Did I... Did I miss a thing to whip over there? Hmm. Or is there, th is there a thing in here that I missed? I thought that I finished everything I needed to that's behind this door, but maybe I didn't. Whoops. Okay, let's take a look. Oh. Forgot about these stupid spider webs. Honestly, this is faster though. Thank you. Okay. Did that, I did that. And that was it for this room, wasn't it? 
Hmm. Nope, not that way. You can do it. There you go. What a catch. Yeah, that was it. So I don't need to come in this room anymore. Alright, I must have missed something in the main room then. Let's see. I do like the designs on these doors. Very floral. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let me go back in to the statue. See if I miss something. So otherwise, the only thing I can think of is something underwater. Unless I missed something else. So let's go up this one. here because I don't see the point of this door right now is there a point to this door right now I don't think there is hmm okay how do we get over there hmm Okay, how do we activate this thing? That. Okay, how do we get up there, though? Hmm. Let's go back up here. I must be missing a switch somewhere. Right? Like... Hmm. Okay, let's take a look at the map again. I did everything in that room that I need to. And to access the basement, I need to go through here. So... Am I missing something over here? What am I missing? Because to activate that water, I need to do that. But how do I get over there? Oh boy. It's a real head scratcher. Unless I do need to go back into that tunnel that I just opened up, which seems like the logical thing, right? But then they made it seem like it was just supposed to be the way out. Gotta be a switch around here or something. Really? Okay. Because this is the way you come back out from the basement, I thought. Oh. Yeah, I guess I really am just wasting time this episode. Oops. In my defense, though, that wasn't as obvious as maybe they want it to be. Because I thought that I looked, but maybe I just didn't do a good job.
No, I'm trying to catch butterflies, dude. Leave me alone. No. And not a single jelly blob to be found. Alright, um, I'm pretty sure. Well, should I should I do rupees or try and draw a fairy? I think. That if you draw a Triforce, which I'm not doing a good job of right now. It is a triangle. Okay. I probably should have just gone for rupees, but that's okay. Hey. Don't, don't do that. Don't. Oh, I can't, I can't even do that. Is he not going to give me anything? Oh, he got one shot, though. Okay. Let's hop up here. There we go. Goodness. Okay. Not too bad. Simple enough. Nope, nope. It's not simple enough. I spoke too soon. <laughs> I wasn't high enough. There we go. Okay. Ow. Get out of here. Okay. There we go. Okay, now let's shoot this guy down. Nope, he's not gonna give us anything. That's okay. All right, hop back up here. Nice and easy. Grab the whip. Hop up here. Oh! Didn't mean to pull out my harp. Okay. Oh, that's exciting. There's no chests in here, right? No. All right, here is nothing. Me. Call me Hugh Jackman because I've been flushed away. Actually, have to do this a little bit differently. I forgot. Got to go up here. Might as well save. Why not? Hey, I'm at 700 rupees even. Nice. Okay. And you have to drop the the um, oh, what are they called? Scotolas from up high to knock over the lily pad. I remember that. Down here. We won't worry about those other two because it doesn't really matter. Okay, and now we get into the fun part of this dungeon. Oh, and I do remember this. We gotta use the whip to grab the key from him. The underground um, music kind of sounds like uh, the Dragon Roost um, cavern music from Wind Waker. 
Hey, there's the boss key. Whatever it is this time around. Oh, he's mad that I stole his key. Woohoo! Juked. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I guess I do go through here. Okay. Oh, there's Rupee down there. Okay, let's see. Well, let's just hop up here and save, because it is time to end the episode. Uh, thank you everybody for watching. Next time we'll try and finish this dungeon, I suppose. I'm um, really hoping that I can, considering how much time I wasted this episode. But Catface closing, so please remember to leave a like, comment, and to subscribe if you enjoyed, and join us again next Tuesday for more Skyward Sword.